than people think. To me, he's one of the more underrated role players in the Big 12. And so a guy like Robert Jones really has to continue to do the things he's done early in this season, which is play with great energy. Yeah, Coach Otzelberger said Kuntz is the steadiest of all the players he's all American who's redshirting this year. And we were talking to him last night. And I said to him, you better watch closely and learn this year how good this league is. And Fred Hoiberg and Doug McDermott, Harrison Barnes. Now the Hilton faithful letting Adam Flagler and the Bears hear it on what they thought was a game of the season into January, sometimes February. That's not this Baylor team. They have a lot of room for improvement. So now Lipsy on the bench for the Cyclones. George, spot up three. Honey. Look good. That time, offensive rebound, and Flagler with the green light. Been good inside the arc. But uh, really struggled. He was about 35% at West Virginia. Two years there, redshirted a third year. That's Another tough, tough oh, two. Oh, Adam didn't get back to the roll, man. And Rob Jones, if there's one thing he does, is he plays with energy. Flagler, single-handedly doing it for back, but it obviously has it. Now he has four fouls, so he's going to have to be substituted in judiciously by T.J. Otzelberger in the final 4:43. Coachable for a kid who was the number three recruit in the uh, ESPN class of 2022. Cyclones set up their D. What did they do so well defensively? Help, help. Five guys on one side of the floor. That's a tough shot right there. Defense to offense, not this time. The rebound on the weak side to Keontae George. Flagler all alone in transition, and that's automatic. Good kick ahead. By